Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling. All right, so today we're going to get into a haul. I have about, not a ton of pieces, but I do have some pieces that I wanted to share with you guys. You guys already know I'm six feet tall as a tall girl, and I say my height a lot because I have a lot of new um, subscribers and they don't know and you can't really tell. But I am six feet tall. The struggle is real for us. However, when I was in New York, I never had a problem. I used to just make things work for me, which is why a lot of the times you'll see me wearing things that are not necessarily from a tall girl brand, but more so a regular brand. That's just because I've learned how to make certain things work for me. Reading details, um, reading the height, the model of the height, which they be lying sometimes, um, but just doing my research. So I'm going to start with this dress that I have on right now. I'm probably going to pop in a video because how the camera is positioned. But if I can step back a little bit, you guys probably still can't see it. Uh, let me see if I can pull the camera down just a smidge it more so you guys can probably see it on me as well as the video. I got my ottoman in here. <laughs> So, I have it on with my um, Jimmy Choo boots. Now, I love these boots, guys. But let me tell you what the issue is. <laughs> when I had them on before, I did not put lotion on my legs. And I felt like I was struggling to get it from my leg, if that makes sense. So now I have on like a high, like a really knee, a high knee high high knee high so it can slide down and I think that's what's happening so it's sliding down just a bit however <laughs> the skirt the dress is short it's not a tall girl brand I just so happened to be going to the mall and I saw it at a friend's shop and I was like oh let me try it looks like it'll fit me but I was nervous because I'm like it's a mini when I was growing up and in school they told us if we wanted to wear a dress to school or a skirt, we had to put our hands down to the side and if our fingertips was past the hem of the skirt, we couldn't wear it to school. So, which is probably why I always opt for like long skirts and stuff like that. But this is like slightly over. I think what saves it would, are the boots. It doesn't make it look like too sleazy on me even though it has like sleeves and stuff I don't know if that makes sense I'm not a mini skirt wearer a lot of the mini skirts now are so short this is short but I think it kind of gives off you know decent let me go let me step back so it's still it's pretty short but I don't feel uncomfortable and I think it's because of the boots it makes me feel like I have on more clothes and it could be the sleeves too um, but this is the first dress. When I get the name of the store, I'll put it in. For those of you guys who live in Georgia, it is at Perimeter Mall. It's called Eluxit. Um, he is on Instagram, so I will put the information below. If I post something on Instagram, I'll tag the, the shop as well. But I, I thought it was pretty cute. And then the sleeves are like, now, if somebody shorter was to wear this, I'm sure the sleeves would probably be, I don't know, it might be a bit too big on them, if that makes sense. It might be a, it might be a bit too big. Only other thing is that this could have been a little bit lower, so I know it's not meant for a tall frame, but I don't think it looks like terrible, if that makes sense. But um, check out the video on this side. But this is the first piece that I bought. I also bought two other things from this shop, something from the Frankie shop, or two things from the Frankie shop that I have to take, you know what, that I have to take back. And then something from Source Unknown. So I am going to show you what I got from, should I go through his stuff first? Let me go through all of this stuff from the first shop. And it's two other items that I purchased, y'all. Y'all know the struggle is real for us tall girls. The other thing is this top. Now, back in the day, 
when I was a little younger, <laughs> I was like a leather girl. Now and days you cannot really find like 100% leather. If you do, it's like super, super expensive. The only thing that I purchased that was not really high and it was lambskin was my Lamarck blazers. And you guys already know I love those jackets, but this is like a pretty, you can't even see the color. It's like a really nice buttery taupe color. I'm probably gonna just wear this with some jeans. I'll, I'll style this up in a second with some jeans and some like slides or something but nothing nothing too crazy and then the other thing i got from his store was the skirt now <laughs> the skirt is like different it has like all these little things on it it's it's different so i'm thinking in my head i'm thinking i could wear it with like sneakers and just like a t-shirt and a crossbody, just very, very chill. I don't know about those Jordan ones because they are not like the most comfortable sneaker. Oh my God, they so cute though. It's just like a piece on the inside of it that keeps like pressing into my foot. And I'm like ready, it's by the, by the top of the shoestring, it's very weird. But these are the pieces that I got from him. So I'll try these on in a way where, how I would actually style them. Um, and I'll probably be in this room as opposed to the other area so you guys can see it. Or maybe, I don't know. Um, but these pieces. And then I also got, let me show y'all from the Frankie shop. The Frankie shop, I got this white shirt. You guys are like, oh, you have like a hundred white shirts. This is like really big and it has shoulder pads, guys. So what I'm gonna do is, this can probably be worn as a dress on somebody like me, even somebody shorter, but if you're not into shoulder pads, this is not for you. And I'm gonna try that on for you guys. And I'm also, hold on. <laughs> I'm also gonna show you guys the skirt that I have to send back to the Frankie shop. I don't feel like taking it out, but I'm gonna show you guys. Cause it's too small. I tried to put it back together as best as possible. It's a red full leather um, skirt. Very nice. Now, I should have known that this mug wasn't going to fit. It said 33 inches, in, um, not inseam, waist, but this is not a 33, guys. I don't, it looks like it would fit. And I'm not going to say that it didn't fit around the waist. It's just too tight. It's really nice, though. Very, very nice. Now, here's the issue. You see this little split in the front? This joint is super high, like super high, you know, and this is for the front, not even the back. <laughs> if it was the back, your butt will show and if it's the front, you know what's showing up there. But it's really, really cute. I wish it was bigger because it definitely would have been a win for my closet, my wardrobe. Um, so this is going back and we're gonna put that away. And then I got the Source Unknown Infamous sweater. They came out with a white color. It's kind of giving me like ivory. And I'll show you guys this as well. Um, the first person I saw with this sweater was Aaliyah's face. And then now Monroe has like every color, I believe. And that's something that I would do. If I like something, I'm gonna probably buy it in all colors. Uh, but the thing about ordering this sweater, it's a little bit different when it comes to like shipping. It actually shipped kind of quick. So they'll tell you like beginning of April, middle of April, a second batch or third batch or something like that. So it doesn't really give you a specific date, but it does give you around what time, what week or yeah of the, the shipment. So I'll try this on for you guys as well and show you guys everything 
that I got that fit. And this is shopping while tall, guys. I already said this before. I do not shop tall girl brands, not on purpose. It's just that the majority of my life, well, my whole life, I've always made regular brands work for me. So me going to a tall girl brand is not my first option because that's not how I shopped for my 40 something years of living, okay? So first for me is let me see what I can find at the mall online. First online, then the mall, and then make it work for me. I'm gonna go to a tailor, I'm gonna do all that stuff. And you know what, since I'm here, I'm actually gonna show you guys. I'm gonna also try on the pants that I cut from my tailor. I'll, I'll show this at the end of the video. But remember I had these pants, guys, and I'll probably try to pop in a video of what they look like before. These are from Zara. And yes, they were high waters. I knew when I bought them purposely. <laughs> but I had her come in and taper the pants and make them shorter. She's really good. So I'll show you guys how these look on me when I get everything else on. So let's get some of the other pieces on and kind of go from there. This shouldn't be a really long video, but I wanted to show you guys what it is like shopping as a tall girl at regular brands and making things work for me. I don't do a ton of hauls because I just kind of been like relaxing, but I wanted to share all these things with you guys. So I'm gonna throw on the Frankie Shop shirt, probably by itself with some shorts, I don't know. But I'll show you guys how long it is on my frame. All right, I'm gonna see if I can turn my camera down a little bit more so you guys can see and I'm gonna step back as far as I can. So, this shirt is long, okay? I'm six feet, it is coming down here, the sleeves are long, and it has shoulder pads, guys, let me show you. <laughs> They're huge. <laughs> shoulder pads are huge. Oh, you can probably see them through it. The jeans are from Zara, pants are from Zara, actually. I got them tailored, because they was a little bit too big around the waist, but yeah. What you guys think? I think this is cool. Wear it with like some shades or something. Let me throw in some shades. And I can probably just, I'm just grabbing stuff that's close to me. <laughs> um, which is this bag, cause I just had it on for a video. But chill, I really, really do like the top. So if you are shorter than me, it's gonna be massive on you because even when I just put it down like this, it's long. You guys know the Frankie Shop, any of their oversized things are going to be extremely oversized, okay? And I've said that before, and this is speaking as a six foot tall woman. Their regular stuff, like the skirt, don't necessarily fit this. The denim skirt that I got from them is really nice, but it is really snug around the waist. And I thought this would be bigger because it was a 33, but it's just too fitted around the leg and the split is way too high in the top. Um, but yeah, here's the shirt. I love it, I love it. It's very chill. Like I said, wear it open because it's very massive or if you wear it closed, do something stylish to it. You can roll your sleeves up and stuff, all that. All right, let's get on the next piece. But let me know what you guys think about this. Are you into like oversized things as a tall woman? Sometimes oversized things can look very masculine on us <laughs> because we're already tall, but we can do things like wear shorts, we can wear like shoes, um, pumps, boots. Even if you did wear sneakers, you could wear this as a dress really really just get creative guys because the struggle is real for us and we have to figure out a way to make things work for us as opposed to being frustrated because we can't find anything to fit our frame so let's get on the next piece and we good guys all right so i just threw on the skirt with the top from his place um i don't have any sneakers on right now but it actually doesn't look bad with this top now they say the skirt is one size fit all when they say that, I sometimes 
don't really <laughs> believe it because elastic sometimes depending on the elastic it can be so tight that it turns into like a regular large um but i think it looks good can you see the bottom of the skirt it has like these little pocket looking things on it i like it so those are the three items that i got from his shop the green dress the skirt and this top also let me show you real quick the frankie shop shirt the shoulder pads have a snap or well, you can't see it so they come out so that's perfect so if you didn't want to wear the shoulder pads one day you can take them out so that's a plus yeah I think it's I think it's cute what do you guys think I think it fits pretty good for a tall girl yeah I know I'm not the biggest girl so it kind of looks like I, you know what it's cute <laughs> I like it with the top I do I just need some more sneakers I was gonna do like a high top but I think I'm actually gonna do a flat yeah like a low top sneaker um but really really nice what you guys think <laughs> all right so I'm going to get on the sweater which is the last piece and then I'm going to the Sun is like taking away the color I'm gonna have to um it's so sunny guys let me turn it down just a smidge it uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get on the sweater last and that is a one-size-fit-all so a good reference would be um, Aaliyah's face she's not tall and Monroe she's not tall either I believe they're both five six or five five and then I'm six feet so you'll see how it looks on them as opposed to me I don't even know how to like link a video I'll maybe I'll try but Monroe she's been wearing them lately so you'll see her with it more so than you would see Aaliyah's face um yeah so let me get on the sweater and let you guys see that but I definitely like how this looks typically I wouldn't tuck in like a leather top like this but I think it looks good yeah so let's get this on and then that and then I'll show you guys the pants that I got um tailored and show you guys how I just make the things work for me so let's get the sweater on and come back all right guys so I decided to put the pants on. I'm gonna step back. I still don't have on any shoes. But if you guys remember, I bought those pants from Zara and they were probably like right here at the ankle. <laughs> they were high waters. But I wanted her to make these into like cargo pants and they came out good. She tapered the bottom for me. My plan is to wear them with some some red boots um, cuz it's like a greenish color so if someone who has the pants from Zara they'll know they're from Zara uh, and then they'll probably say like what did she do with her pants or whatever but here's the sweater all right so Monroe like I said she's like five six I think she's five six and I think Aaliyah is the same height so you guys can see how it actually fits me on the website they'll have the sweater like off the shoulder like this it seems a little bulky like that to me so you can kind of like play with the front of it I'm looking in the mirror play with the front of it it's a one size fit all sweater that's why it can fit me and all the other girls so it's meant to be oversized so what y'all think <laughs> the sweater is about 168 is it worth the 168 mm. as far as style yes um the sweater is okay it's not like super fabulous i have sweaters that are like top tier top tier but this is nice the style is different again when you order them it's like 
beginning of April, first batch, second batch, third batch, things like that. Um, if you're interested, I am going to link this below. I'm going to link the Zara pants again for you guys. I don't know if I linked them before, but I am going to link them. But again, they do not come like this. I had my lady go ahead and chop them up. Okay? Oh, um, <laughs> but that's all I have for you guys today in this video. Quick little haul. So things from the Frankie shop. Um, things from Eluxit. The boutique in Perimeter Mall. And what else? Was that it? I think that was it. Oh, <laughs> and the sweater. <laughs> Source unknown, guys. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it's not too long. But if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY and my personal style blog. Pop that in. <laughs> Coco Styles NYC. And my style services, CocoStylesNY.com. And I'm on tickety tickety talk, Coco Styles NYC, guys. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.